looking at this fuel pump, we see on the side of it is the fuel shutoff solenoid. And so this solenoid right here is an electrically powered coil that's going to create a magnetic field and pull an armature or a cylinder, a steel rod, and it's going to pull it up into place. And so the way these work, these solenoids are actually a 100% duty cycle. In other words, when the key is on in the run or start position, this solenoid is energized and that ener energized solenoid will stay energized for the entire time the engine is running. What I mean by that is if this engine was running and I came and I cut these wires, I would de-energize the solenoid and that would remove or cancel or eliminate the electromagnetic field that's being created and this spring-loaded rod would drop back down and it would shut the engine off. And so electrically when it's on, this rod pulls up and this actually controls our fuel delivery. And so we have a electronic or electrical, sorry, it's not electronic, in, in other words, it's not proportional, it's discrete, it's on or off. And so it's an electrical device that's moving a mechanical linkage that's actually controlling our fuel. And so our fuel shutoff is electric that's controlling a mechanical position within the fuel pump.